السلام عليكم السلام عليكم الله Uh, for instance, I got a question, Sheikh. This has been like, like uh, for the last uh, 10 years. Uh, whenever actually I go and read a stand for a namaz, I I don't get waswasas, alhamdulillah, but what actually I do get is something very different. I, as if, I don't know how to explain, as if somebody is suffocating my throat and my heart directly starts to beat really, really fast. It happens on each and every prayer. Uh, the moment I see I stand, it happens. The moment I actually come out of the mosque, it gets back to normal state. And I feel like running back to the home. Uh, and it's like five, ten years. And I really can't really help it. I okay, really I, I will answer you, Irfan. Now, Irfan is suffering from, he says he doesn't have any whispers or whispers in Salat, but he feels something is suffocating him and pulling his clothes and he gets anxiety attacks. <laughs> if this is not whispers, what would be whispers? This is the mother of all whispers, Akhi. Salat is supposed to be a place for your sanctuary where you, where you find tranquility. If you get these whispers and anxiety and, and these, these suffocating feelings and anxiety attacks, this is a clear sign that one of two. Either you are delusional and you're allowing things to mess up your subconscious and you're convincing yourself that you're suffering and this needs psychiatric attention. Or there is some form of evil eye and this is what's causing it. Maybe someone a couple of years ago watched you praying and you did not say your adhkar on that morning and he was impressed by the way you're praying, so he gave you an evil eye. This is why you're suffering. And the remedy is very easy. Do ruqya on yourself. And hopefully, inshallah, in five days to one week, you're all good. And you will say, Jazakallah khair, Sheikh Asim, you've, you've saved me and helped me from this uh, calamity. What is the ruqya? Bring like a dozen bottles of water, take the cap off, recite Fatiha, three times, one, and repeat that twice, three times, then ayat al-kursi, three times, blowing after each time, the last two verses of Surah al-Baqarah, آمن الرسول بما أنزل إليه من ربيه والمؤمنون, three times, and after each time you blow, and then the last three quls, chapter 112, 113, 114. This is one set, blow, read the set again, then blow, and a third time, and Drink from these bottles in the morning and afternoon, the evening before you go to bed. Put them in your backpack, wherever you go, carry a bottle. Drink only from these with the intention of recovery and cure. And in your sujood, make a lot of dua that Allah Azza wa Jal relieves you from any illness, any uh, sort of anxiety during prayer. Five days max, five days to one week, inshallah, you'll be good as new bi